Just like that, we're back in Italy. Welcome back to a new video. I've actually been away for two weeks now. Like I've been back in Italy for about two weeks. Sorry, there hasn't been, there's been a lot going on, but I haven't, um, I haven't recorded or I haven't filmed much because as soon as I got back, um, I got kind of sick and I'm just, starting to feel better now I think I was just a little bit ran down and I was stressing myself out thinking of all the things I needed to do so there's been a lot going on I had my cousin's wedding which was actually very very nice I had a great time with the whole family and I spent time my sister was able to come from Canada so she's been here about three weeks and she is leaving this Sunday this Sunday coming uh, today is August 29th so it's been a while but but we've had a great time sorry for the noise I think they're doing some work just close to here but it's been a great time and today we're going to Rome we're going to see my friend Jamie Lee um, which is <laughs> it's a very weird situation because we always we don't see each other often we used to work together as a flight attendant so but since I left we see each other about once or twice a year maybe and always we both live in Canada but we always end up seeing each other in a different country. So the last time that I saw her, a lot of traffic today. So the last time I saw her was actually in Dublin last year. And now I'm gonna go see her in Rome with my sister today. It's a very interesting hangout because it's always in a different city. <laughs> So we used to live together in Vancouver as well. So we're all over the place. But that's what makes it interesting, I guess. So it's gonna be nice to catch up. Uh, we're gonna go for a walk around the city. Not too long, I don't think, because the weather has been really, really hot here. So I also think that's why I got sick, because I did a little bit of in-between weather. I went from pretty chilly Ireland to very, very warm Italy and then some air conditioning in the middle. I'm not really used to having AC on and I don't know, sweating and then running in the rain, running under the sun. I think all of this plus I was just go, go, go and yeah, it got sick. But now I'm okay or getting better. Actually today is the first day that I'm actually much, much better. But all this to say that yeah, we're going to Rome. So, we're going to Rome. Let's go on a great fun day out in Rome. I'll see you there. Oh, you're so cute.
Good morning, everybody. I look like I'm like I'm about to go for a run because I am. It's been a while since I actually talked to you. It's now September, September second, actually. <laughs> I think I am so confused with this video right now, just because I'm all over the place with it. I've been taking shots here and there, but not doing like uh, my regular, you know, like videos and stuff because. That's why I said it's been really, really hot. I have to show you this. Like, look at this. <laughs> I have a friend. <laughs> it's it's really hard to get some energy to do stuff when uh, it's that hot, and it's nonstop. Like right now, I because you can tell I am ready to go for a run. I'm actually doing sprints right now and it's it's gonna be i'm gonna talk about it in a few seconds but oh my god it's full of mosquitoes as well okay excuse me sir okay when it when it's this <laughs> dude chill okay just in the in the mornings I find like around this time uh, of day which is yeah like at 6 6 30 um, up until 8 a.m. it's a very nice time to be outside but that's when I actually get up and go for a run and so I, tr I try to do all my exercising and workouts early in the morning before the sun hits all this just to say i'm sorry this video might not be the best but hopefully the next ones will be better moving on as i said it's well now it's 6 44 but um i usually wake up at 6 a.m and go for my my runs today it's a bit later just because it's i'm doing sprints and it's not gonna take me long it's about about 10 15 minutes usually just because they're go 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 um, I have a 10 second sprint with a 30 second recovery jog and that's for 15 times so that's a non-stop so 10 seconds on 30 seconds recovery and then you start all over again for 15 times and yes it sounds like it's not too too bad but you know what in the moment it sucks so I uh, feel like I'm a little bit uh, procrastinating right now just because I'm scared of doing it but I did it two days ago I think I survived so we'll do it again and then yeah we'll start our day basically also can we just look at this dude right here look at this Ooh, and look at my shoes these are gonna be my my marathon running shoes I just got them not too long ago like last week I think and I love them look at that this color wow hello oh wow he's a model he is a model Okay, let's go. Done. I'm nice and sweaty. And I'm gonna go have a shower first and then have breakfast and my coffee. Coffee is always <laughs> the thing that gets me out of bed. I love mornings here. They're always so calm and quiet, aside from cars passing by and the birds singing. But aside from that, it's a gorgeous morning. <clears throat> and I like running during this time because there's nobody around. I'm trying to keep quiet also because my parents are still sleeping. So, so yeah, and uh, oh, I also forgot to say that, yeah, yesterday my sister 
uh, went back to Canada. So we took her to the airport and then it was Sunday so we just had like a very quiet day. Um, we did we did bake some delicious traditional Roman pastries. Uh, which are called Maritazzi. Um, I might add a photo just so you can see. Um, they're so good. They're a, they're basically a brioche filled with whipping cream and they always have them at the um, sorry dripping. They always have them at the pastry shops here in Italy and they're delicious. So good. And I do have to finish a nutrition course that I started. It's a last course that I have um, and that I signed up along with my running coach course and my personal training course which I already finished so I have just a nutrition course to do and yeah I need to finish that as well. I'm gonna be around the house the whole day I think and yeah you can tell that it people are waking up because traffic is intensifying. Sorry before you go if you're looking for running shoes fast running shoe to run your marathons in I do suggest these so corny ones. I think that's how you pronounce the brand. Uh, I'm gonna uh, add it here. Um, but yes, oh my gosh, these are amazing. The Nikes don't really work for me, for my foot. I had a few problems with them and they gave me like an ankle issue. So I'm not using Nikes at all. Now I use Hoka's for my training days and I also ran my two other marathons in Hoka's um, but yeah like Sokani ones are pretty good so I suggest, I suggest trying different brands just because you might find a really good one and it doesn't have to be like a very very you know like the f popular ones that everybody runs in that's what I think and um, yeah these ones are really really good I love the color as well like you can see me coming from far away I love that anyways off we go I'm ready. Um, had, we had a little bit of a problem this morning because the water wasn't working, it wasn't coming out, and so we had to figure that one out. But it's all done. Uh, it's now 10:15, and as you can tell, the world is alive. We have a kindergarten right beside us, so lots of kids yelling and traffic. But it's good. It's you know. September so we're back into that very busy life anyways I just wanted to come on to talk about something that I have been loving I got it in Canada it's a Canadian brand it's called salty face this is what it is so it's tanning drops and I got the face one they have a body one as well and and I love using it because I feel like it gives me a bit of a glow. So my face is usually lighter than my upper body. My legs are very, very light. I have runner's legs in the sense that I have the my lower legs are very are kind of tanned and then very white because you can tell that I wear shorts for running. But anyways, moving on from that, um, I love putting. A bit of this on so it, it comes with a brush but I just spray a little bit on it just like that and then you just apply it all over your face it's almost like a massage as well I love doing that feels very nice don't put too much on because once I did that and you could really tell that my face was very dark. It kind of looked patchy as well, so not the nicest. But a little bit goes a long way with this. And it takes about 8 hours to develop, so you won't see it 
right away at all. But then after a while, it just looks very nice on. And I like that it's also vegan. I'm just gonna leave that to develop. And I am now going to do some work. Uh, we have a few recipes to make and to take photos of. And yeah, that's gonna be my day. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun.